So I'm going to start by harmonising an A major scale, sounds like this. Now that doesn't sound much like an A major scale, does it? And the reason it sounds like that is because I'm harmonising using intervals of a fourth. Now that's what jazz musicians call quartal harmony. Now if I was to harmonise using intervals of a third, it would give us a much more obviously major sound. So that sounds like I'm playing a major scale. But these fourth intervals give you this really cool modern jazz sound. Now this kind of ties in with what I was talking about a couple of weeks ago because I did a video about playing uh, using fourth intervals in your lines and creating a modern jazz sound by using more fourth intervals. But I thought after doing that video that that's kind of only half the story. So I should talk about how to actually use quartal chord voicings on the bass because the bass is set up for playing quartal harmony. It's harmonized in intervals of a fourth. The, the bass is tuned in intervals of a fourth. So all you need to do on a lot of these chord voicings is just play the same fret on three different strings. So you can literally play it with one finger so it always amazes me that more bass players don't use these kind of sounds because the bass is so well set up for this kind of thing. Now you notice I'm using six string. I couldn't resist using the six string for this video because the voicings just sound so good on six string, but you can adapt these onto four string. Normally I do my tabs for four string, but today I've kept the tabs for six string. But as I say, you can use ex these exact same principles on four string, five string basses and it does work. And you can also apply it to, to kind of you know, any scale, any mode, any key. I'm sticking with A as my root note because it's useful to have that, that open A string as my kind of reference note. So this is what a Dorian scale would sound like harmonizing intervals of a fourth. So this is A Dorian now. Okay, so that was a Dorian mode harmonizing intervals in the fourth. And so all of the modes of the major scale will work very well for harmonizing this way. Um, and also you can really apply it to any scale that you want. So I was thinking today about, um, you know, melodic minor. So a melodic minor, how would that work harmonizing intervals of a fourth? Now the a melodic minor is a funny one because the way that the intervals work, not all of the fourth intervals come out as perfect fourths. So you've got, um, you've got augmented fourths, which are a bit kind of out there sounding. And you've also got one of the intervals comes out as a major third. So not necessarily all of these voicings are strictly quartal, but this is how it would sound anyway. And I'll leave you to decide how many of these, these chords are, are you know really useful, usable chords. But there's some definitely interesting stuff in here. So it sounds like this. This is A melodic minor harmonized in quartal harmony. Mm -hmm. 